to the channel thanks for clicking in i know it's been a while since i made a build video like this um been a while since i really been on i've been doing dealing with a lot i know i explained it before in one of my other videos but um yeah we're back we're gonna do a little something today um my last video i just posted the crawler that you see in front of you basically put together from the chassis um everything you see here was already put together so i kind of felt bad um the reason why you see it like this is because i felt bad that i built it basically without showing you guys me putting it together so what i did here was take it apart so that way those of you that do not you know really understand how to put everything together that you already do, do not have experience building a crawler well i'm gonna do it here so that's basically why you see everything taken apart um but i'm also going to be doing a few different things with uh bumpers but I'm, I'm still gonna put those together for you i'm gonna put everything here together for you plus show you the add-ons that i have for the body that i have coming for it which should be here today um so let's just get into it i'm not gonna really do too much talking i just want to do the build show you guys how everything goes together the wheels i've been put together b locks i already put them all together so i just took everything apart from the chassis but i left the wheels together you can see the wheels are b lock metal original and great um do have good foam in them and everything so right so we're gonna start i got the um everything you see here is just about basically all from injura separate uh so i got it i ordered everything even a few of the accessories from them as well and i like it because it's all aluminum you know anodized the chassis is carbon fiber the battery plate is carbon fiber the only thing i did leave on was the braces for the bumpers which holds the chassis together but everything else i've taken apart um, got everything separate like I said and put it together. I also have servo that's gonna go. This one has a couple in it, but this is a servo from Injora, which is the 35, and that's gonna go in it as well. I have the metal, um, there's a carbon fiber mount for the servo with the red anodized as well, like the same color for the servo. I have to the tow hitch which is a winch um this is a hook one that folds down it's also aluminum got these accessories these i'm gonna actually i'm gonna paint these um the handles are gonna be black but everything else will be silver and i'm gonna add them to the body separately this is aluminum the jack jack stand whatever you want to call it these are the lights well, if you know the body you know the lights you'll see it yeah i'm putting a light kit on it as well here's a fire extinguisher that's there um what else let me see if so i can see everything fire extinguisher little accessories for the body gas tank little uh cloth this is a strap for the a strap for the body for the battery i'm sorry and the clips which i don't think i'll be using the clips for this one and that and i have chain with the hooks these put these on it um so front bumper back bumper everything is in jar the only thing is this brace, when they sent it, is darker than this one. Chassis brace, which is the bumper holder, whatever you want to call them. So that's fine. It's okay. It's still aluminum, still works, still does function. So I have these. Also enjoy shocks. Put them together. Good. Everything here is aluminum. So let's just get the build going so you can keep up. I don't want this video to be too long. So we'll start off first, obviously. Let's just get these out of the way. These are great, great wheels. I can't wait to see how they look on everything. When it's like the body's on it, everything's mounted good. Let's see. I also got these little aluminum um, lock nuts for the scent for the wheels. The inside, you see. Then it has a little design on it. Cool. Um, got all four of them. And they came with, uh, obviously, to put them on and lock them. You can see it. It's a little one right there. Big old fingers out of the way. Yeah. Um, these washers are for the wheels, so they lock them nice and tight and they're not wobbling. Get these out the way. All right. So what we're gonna start off with is this chassis. So let me get everything right there, so you guys can see good. We're gonna start off with the chassis, and um, let's see which one is. This is the front because the battery tray is gonna go up front, so this is gonna be the front. So the first thing I'm going to do is we're going to connect the battery tray so obviously everything else is there this is separate but it's just a bracket to hold it together 
from it's also aluminum it's a, this will hold it together on the chassis so just got one screw plus the four on the sides and that's easy but the four on the sides um hold it together when you put the shock mounts on it which is also pretty easy so um i believe that's these are two millimeters yeah the two millimeter so you just take it off put it on and yeah like i said this is also carbon fiber which is good and cool i mean it has a really good look to it so i'm gonna put it tight yet yeah, because you gotta line it up to the screw holes on the side right about there we'll just put the side mounts on these are all everything is metal which is, is is great i love it um Great. Right, so I'm just gonna keep building guys. I'm gonna just keep building and I guess I'll play a little music And I guess um as I'm doing it Don't worry about my big hands in the way. Sorry But as I build it I'm showing you everything that I put together
So what I had to do, in case I'm sure some of you noticed, if not all of you, I had to change these two links back around because when I flipped the whole axle over, these remained backwards, so I had to fix them, but that was it. Quick quick and easy fix. That was nothing. It's just, it's confusing though sometimes, you know, if you don't pay attention to every single little thing and angles, but it's all right. It was nothing major. It was a quick fix. Back on track. That's the whole thing, may not have gone as easy, but it, it, it's, it's together, you know. Video has been long enough, guys. I'm sorry, I tried to do it a little faster, but everything is locked in, everything works. I'm actually working, the spinning, everything's on. I'm gonna stop there because the video is long enough. My next one will be. I'm gonna put the tires on. I'm gonna add um, the servo, the electronics, and then after that, the next one will be the body because uh, the body that's coming in has to be put together. Um, so while I'm building the body, I'll be putting accessories on it as well, and then the electronics. So appreciate you guys. Thanks for sticking with me. I'll see you guys on the next one. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hit that button. Look at that, nice and smooth.
We also, um, one more thing, on these I'm gonna grease up this. I have some marine grease, I'm gonna open this up and grease them both, front and back. And then, uh, a little bit of them there. But that's it. So, like, subscribe guys, thanks for watching. See you guys on the next one. Enjoy the rest of your day.